Yeah, what is up my people in today's video? I'm gonna go ahead and break down the final boss Show you all the encounters and how to slap this content what not to do uh, I definitely don't want you guys to get this far, you know, because it could be a it could be a struggle and then have to go through this You know what I'm saying? So I'm trying to avoid this and I want you guys to uh, go ahead and learn man All right, that's that's my only goal right here. And I hope you guys enjoy this man <laughs> Let's get it, yo. <laughs> oh, no, what just happened? Uh. All right, my people, as you can see, this is an amazing raid. I love it. I love all the mechanics. And, dude, there's, there's no better feeling than destroying the boss at the end, man, getting that loot. And you know, I want you guys to feel the same thing I feel with the right, boys. Yeah. So, it's going, it's going, it's going. right here at the end, there what is a white mechanic. So make sure you uh, shoot that rocket right there, and then you'll be done. First try. It only gonna take one first rocket at the end, but uh, let's yeah, go ahead. I'll explain everything else to you right here. All right, my people, this is what you see when you walk in, and I just want to give you guys some positioning because that's all I really feel like it that matters. So. On this right side, you're gonna have big bowl that you can get two players in, okay? So that's gonna be our two DPS. On this far side, we can go ahead and we can get three DPS on this far side. That way they can control the room and whenever the big heavy comes out, they can kill the heavy, all right? You need to kill the heavy because the heavy drops a key to this machine gun. The dude that grabs the key, preferably a tank, can come back here and start to stand in the area to upload until you get to 100 percent and then you can use the terminal okay once you use the terminal the machine gun is going to work for your favor and it's going to destroy some of these train cards okay you have to at first always destroy the bullet which is a white mechanic okay so i'll show you right now what i'm talking about so so up here this is the way that the train looks right there's four guns on the train and then this is the white mechanic all right when this bullet comes in all right, so right here, once he gets to 100, he's going to go ahead and activate the terminal. And the machine gun is going to destroy the first turret on the train, okay? Once that turret gets destroyed, it's going to show you a weak point, a red weak point, all right? So what you want to do now is you want to grab these rockets and you want to shoot them at the weak points, okay? So once you break that first uh, weak point, then the white mechanic is going to begin, okay? The white mechanic is the big red bullet on top of the train, when it goes into the chamber and fully locks, then you get destroyed. If you see it right there, this is the white mechanic, okay? This thing is deadly, so shoot all your rockets at it, all right? It takes like six to eight rockets, and that way, the setup that you have, the one healer on your right can heal everybody. The tank on your left can take the machine gun and still hold the door, and then you'll have your other tank running the machine gun, you know, getting the 100% and then putting in the code, which is always going to be by your name right here, as you can see. So, one of the tanks should be running Tardigrade, one of the tanks should be running Vanguard. If you want to check my video from yesterday, you can. That'll help you the most, like, knowing exactly how your build should look, in my opinion, okay? DPS, you can run any DPS you like, either whether it's the one-tap build, whether it's the focus build, whether it's just an AR build, whatever you're more comfortable with, all right? But make sure this is the priority always until you destroy this, and then you can work on whatever else you're trying to do, okay? So... With that being said, I might as well explain a little bit more. So once you destroy this uh, white mechanic, it's going to get rid of this electrical field, okay? So I want to say this, yo. So after you destroy this at first, you're going to have to destroy each turret. So there's four turrets across the train, all right? So make sure you're charging up the machine gun. Once you're done charging it up to 100%, whoever has the code, you get these from the Chunga. I, I want, I'm going to try to be like repeating myself as much as i can so i can be super clear after you get this key from the chunga you have to come back to the machine gun charge up the machine gun put in the key to the machine gun once it hits 100 percent, and then it's going to take out this hard cover on the turret and then it's going to make it a a weak point okay it's going to give it a weak point with the machine gun as you saw once you do that after you kill the white mechanic because this is the white mechanic this is the most important thing in the game all right once you're done killing that, on the first run only, you're going to destroy all four turrets. All right, you're going to destroy the last one. And then once that happens, the boss is going to come out. Okay, so this is the first phase. So, bomb, the boss comes out. So, from now on, I want you to know that you're not going to have to worry 
about the turrets on the train anymore, okay? Your only job now is to kill the white mechanic. DPS her. Come here. You don't want to DPS her until you're done with the white mechanic. Because she's going to bombard the whole map like this, okay? And if you get tagged, just get out of there. Because as you saw, if you're tagged and you stay in, you have a chance at killing the whole team. Even if you're at the end on the last part, her last, just her health bar is left. You know, you can still wipe, guys. So be careful. And, you know, play strategically, all right? Your tank stands in the front to take the machine gun aggro. You're going to all move ahead. And you're just going to rinse and repeat the wipe mechanic, okay? All right, so once your boys are done with the white mechanic, the electricity is going to go away. And then you're going to be able to go to the middle and hold it down, okay? So, boom. We don't have to worry about the four turrets no more. Pro tip. Shout out to the homie Sleep. We're going to go ahead and go to the underground right here. And we're going to chill under the earth shaker, okay? We want to DPS her at this point, And we want to do as much damage as we can, okay? We got to rip off her helmet. That's the goal right here. Yeah, if you don't DPS her, you won't knock her into the next phase. So make sure once you get here, you guys are ready to DPS. So all your five or whatever four DPS that you have on the team, whatever amount of players that are DPS, usually we have like five. You guys can uh, go ahead and rip off her helmet. See that beautiful hair like my boy says. Make sure you're killing these uh, rocket launchers because they'll hit you and they'll knock down the shields. And then the machine gun will kill you. So you always want to make sure you're bodying those boys. So any ads outside of the outside of this area are also going to die to the bombardment. And now it's basically just rinse and repeat. All right. It's going to get a little harder every time you have to rinse and repeat because you're going to have new things coming at you. All right. So the train is going to have like LMGs. The lady is going to be going crazy rocketing you over and over. You know, you're going to have mortar rounds from the train and it's just going to be a crazy experience. But. Make sure your Vanguard is doing his job properly. Make sure your healer is doing his job. And both were doing great yesterday on our team. So, so you basically just want to keep doing what you've been doing the whole entire time. So just keep killing her. You don't want to DPS her until you're in the pit, guys. Because if you DPS her, she's going to drop mortars. And you're not going to be able to get into the pit because it's electrified. Because you still have the white mechanic up there. So if you have the white mechanic, you still have the electricity. Okay, so take out the white mechanic. Go down there, DPS her, let her do her mortar phase. So yeah, once again, once you hit the last rocket for the mechanic, you're going to take off the electricity. You're going to go to the bottom. You can see she's a bad, bad woman. So I'm going over here. We're leaving the turrets up. We're killing the snipers. We're getting to the pit. We're going to DPS her now the best we can. And then she's going to knock us into the next phase. Try to, like, stay still, too, when you're DPSing behind the shield. That way you're not taking, like, your teammate's shots, right? She's going to go over there, start the bombardment. She's going to go to her room. After you have rinse and repeat it twice, you're going to go ahead and get Iron Horse, okay? So Iron Horse now means you have to destroy the train. So the way you're going to destroy the train is the same way we've been doing it. We're going to practice on keeping all our focus on the white mechanic, okay? So make sure you're staying away from your team. Because if you're together on this radius, when it explodes, you're going to damage each other even more, okay? So make sure you're getting away from your teammates and you're playing as smart as you can. I'm dodging the machine gun right here. And yeah, this, we've done it three times, man. And, and every time, you know, I, I've done the same strategy and it's worked perfect for our group. We even got we even have uh, people that have got the Ravenous on our squad, man. And, it, and it's pretty pretty cool to know that, you know. All you got to do is just try your best and you're able to get uh, some of the coolest items in the game, man. I'm so uh, excited to get my own. Then I can make some uh, dope content for you guys. But yeah, one shot in the rocket, dudes. That way you don't have to like spend any time getting the RPGs and handling your business. So once you see the Iron Horse uh, mechanic... So for this last part, you just have to clear the white mechanic and then you're going to destroy each turret on the train cards. All right. So each turret only takes two rockets. All right. And the white mechanic, the big bullet takes like six to eight, like I said earlier. 67 million right there on the headshot. So after you destroy every uh, cart on the train, you have to hit the machine one more time to destroy the middle of the train. As you just saw, the middle of the train is going to get destroyed by the machine gun. And then you're going to be able to go to the bottom and you're going to DPS her again. She's going to do a mortar phase. And then you'll just have to kill her again after that. 
and it, it is pretty simple in my opinion it's just you know new to us and we just have to get our mechanics down and understand how we should play you know and i hope this side helps you guys man i did the best i could with this strategy and guide and yeah i'll try to make you like crispier uh, guides in the future but since this is so fresh man you know i think this is a pretty good uh guy for you guys no lie but yeah it's gonna get pretty hectic man npcs are gonna be coming from everywhere the bombs are gonna be like relentless and now you just have to kill her one more time and then destroy the, the the train with the last rocket okay make sure you keep one rocket for this last phase when you're gonna go uh into her health and this would be really good for like a health damage build right here you would just rip her no lie got on a headshot build but it's good because like i could kill the rocket launchers instantly right all right so last rocket right here all right this is the last mechanic to actually destroy the train and then uh congrats to everybody that you know that was on your raid team man gg i hope this helped let me know in the comments if you have any questions or what you think you know if i missed out on anything i would appreciate uh, any info you guys ever give me and i'll catch you later on the stream in in a little bit so peace salute take care of yourselves